Good evening, I'm Joey Parker. And I'm Marissa Holloway. We've had quite the roller coaster of weather after the couple of, in the past couple of days. And we're going to be checking in with Sharon in just a, a minute on this one. But imagine sending your child to school with lunch money, only to find out they're coming home hungry. That's right. And that's exactly what one parent says, that a former lunch lady has been stealing children's money and not letting them eat. Sources tell us the money she embezzled could be roughly $250,000. New at 6 tonight, ABC 17's Lindsay Henry joins us with more details about the parent who claims the lunch lady stole food out of the children's mouths. This all started several years ago when several Camdenton School District parents started realizing their children weren't eating lunch when they had paid for it. $250,000? That's a lot of lunch money. That's a lot of lunches. That's a lot of kids. A few years ago, Nancy Stewart's son was a student at Camdenton High School. She says that every Monday she'd send him to school with enough money to pay for a week of lunches. He'd give that money to the woman swiping the student cards. The next day, however, that same woman would tell him he didn't have enough money to eat. The woman that was accepting their money and, you know, here, let me have your lunch money and putting it in her pocket is the same woman that said, I'm sorry, you have a charge, you don't get to eat, and taking the tray and dumping it in the trash. Over the last few weeks, the Camdenton Police Department has been investigating this case, and the woman in question has been let go from her job. Stewart says she's been trying to collect enough signatures to get the state auditor's office to investigate the district because she says she wants to know where all the money went. If each child would have just $2 to eat for lunch, that would amount to 125 lunches not eaten. If you were to go and ask other parents if they, you know, if their kids, they would tell you, the kids would tell you the same thing. After talking with other parents, she's found that many others have had the same problem with their children's lunch money. She says that she just wants to know why someone could be so selfish and steal food from kids' mouths. You know, how many were there? How many kids did she impact? How many families did she, did, how many people went to that school and said, you know, what's happening with my kids' lunch money? and it was put back on the kid and the kid didn't do anything wrong but you know because of that this individual the suspicion was put back over onto that kid well now a parent thinks that their kids lying to him over lunch money and it was her the whole time we did try speaking with the Camdenton R3 school district officials and they did decline to go on camera. However, they did tell us that this investigation is ongoing and that charges should be coming out soon. In Camdenton, Lindsay Henry, ABC 17 News. If you'd like to find out more information about the petition or you're a concerned parent and want to sign it, we have the contact information on our website at abc17news.com.